Wow. Wow. This guy find it. Found a really nice, uh, nice new kite. And we're going to tell you all about it. Hello, kite boarders. Uh, this is Brian. Uh, he's the inventor of this, uh, this new kite. So, uh, Brian, uh, how do you call it? Uh, this is called the Ninox. Yeah. And uh, it's a hybrid single skin kite. It means uh, it's for um, for a part single skin, and yeah. For a part closed cell, um, uh, which means you can uh, relance it from the water, and uh, it's very light. So yeah. You can use it in uh, just a few knots. Oh, so it's uh, it's the best of a couple of different worlds. I think so. <laughs> oh, okay. So uh, we know uh, single skin kites. We know twin skin kites. You know, we know uh, all different kind of foil kites. So. Uh, what did you to decide to uh, to make this kite? What did you miss in all the other uh, other kites? Um, well, I, I was searching for something light as possible. Yeah. I uh, was looking on strutless and on just normal single skins, but um, yeah, a lot of people ask, yeah, why doesn't it relance from the water? Yeah. So that was the main thing, and it's possible now. Okay, With perfect. So. So how long can you leave it on the water when it's uh, when it cracks down? Yeah, very long. Very, very, very long? long. Yeah. We're gonna have to test this, eh? Yeah, we're gonna we have can, to test uh, this. We can take a test on it. Oh, perfect. Uh, do, do, so we, cool. do we believe uh, Brian on his uh, big blue eyes? <laughs> yes, <laughs> I don't have blue eyes. Oh, <laughs> I don't have blue eyes. Ah, that's the mystery. <laughs> so, uh, Brian, uh, this uh, kite is all white. It's uh, only just a prototype. And... Um, uh, the final version will have some uh, nice colors and uh, nice graphics too. Okay, and if, one, uh, if people want to have more information uh, about, uh, about the kite? MonyetKiteboarding.com MonyetKiteboarding.com people, we are remember that. We are also on Facebook and Instagram for some nice pictures. Ah, perfect. Uh, well, we're going to test this kite and uh, show you all about it. And um, yeah, if you, wanna, if you have some questions, uh, just put it down in the comments and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Hey, hey, Andre, yeah. can we see the kite uh, from close? Is, it, how, how is that possible, Brian? Can we? Uh, it's still secret. It's secret. With, with the next, with the next, next version. version uh, we have an up close and personal. For now, it's all still a secret. Stability test. So we'll see if this uh, kite drops out of the air. So uh, Brian, uh, how much wind do we have today? Well, like uh, eight, eight knots something maybe. So it's around uh, eight knots. It's uh, quite stable every now and then. We have a little gust. We just uh, yank on the front line. You can see it's uh, hardly impossible uh, to get it out of the air. So it's a really nice and, uh, and uh, stable frame. What we've seen on skates as well, if you go really straight toward the kite, it drifts uh, like a madman. So uh, yeah, really anxious to see if we get a production model in the bigger sizes, because it will be probably a really nice dream for, uh, for hydrofoiling people. Kite like this. Can you uh, do the stability test a little bit more on the side, Pitson? On the Andre? side of the edge of the wind window, no worries. So now the car is on the edge of the wind window. And over here you can see the same stability appears. So it's uh, really hard to get it out of the air. So uh, Brian tried to make a, a single skin kite that could float. But in the end, I don't really think it's uh, necessary that it floats, because uh, it just stays up there. So now we're gonna test the relaunch. So, single skin kite that's relaunchable. Brian is demonstrating that at the moment. Wow! Wow! Wow, Brian! Brian, that was really amazing! Wow, nice! Thanks! I think this kite would be good for schools also, is it? For... Yeah, it's also really stable and uh, easy handling. 
Yeah. Nice, uh, nice for schools. You can not only teach uh, teach on land, but also uh, on water. So yeah, it's, also uh, on water, on snow. Yeah, it's, and it's like very a, soft power. So. Yeah. So you only need uh, need one uh, one kite uh, to do it all. Yeah. More lessons, less pumping. More lessons, <laughs> less pumping. That's it, people. Yeah, Brian, it worked uh, worked really really well. So uh, now it's uh, waiting for uh, for the full line uh, production models. Yes. And then uh, we will write a full review on the production model and uh, tell you all about it. I give you guys a call when the big size is uh, arrived. Yeah, okay. that would be nice. <laughs> so let us know what you think of uh, Brian's uh, new kite. And uh, don't forget to uh, keep watching on uh, kitefinder.com.